holy shit guys i just saw the fedex truck drive like i don't know if you you can't see outside but that road out there i saw them drive which means they should be coming around any minute to bring me the computer and i'm so excited like you don't understand how excited i am it's time it is time <laughs> McGee, McGee TV. TV. All right, guys. So it is officially here. <sighs> FedEx just dropped it off. My iBuy Power gaming PC is here. Now I will say this: I'm a little bit upset with the quality of the packaging. Uh, there's parts of this that are just like laying open. I really hope that my computer is not broken because I have waited almost a month for this damn thing. But uh, without any further uh, delay. We're gonna go ahead and get into it. All right, guys, so now it's time to unbox this bad boy. Like I said, I'm really not all that impressed with the quality of the packaging, especially being somebody that I work for a shipping company, uh, shipping things out that are relatively expensive. I know that something like this really wouldn't pass, but as long as my computer's okay, I'm fine. As long as there's no damage, I'll be fine. Now, I did wait almost a month for this to get here. I ordered this on Super Bowl Sunday, and today is the 23rd of February, so it does take some time. But what you guys do have to understand is this build that I bought is not a free build. Yes, they built it for me, but this is a custom made gaming PC. I really had to let them take some time to build it and make sure everything was right. One thing I will really give iBuyPower a great review on is the fact that they keep you updated every step of the way. When the parts are being gathered, you know about it. When all the parts have been gathered, you know. They let you know when it passes QA steps. It tells you everything. As well, I also did get my own personal sales rep who reached out to me and just kept me updated through the whole process, let me know when things were going okay, answered some questions that I have, and it turns out actually that he contacted me to let me know that there were some free upgrades available that they were just gonna give me without me even having selected them. I've actually been upgraded to uh, 16 gigs of DDR, 3000 RAM instead of 2400. I got an upgrade from a 300 watt power supply to a 700 watt, which originally I meant to buy a 700 watt anyways and forgot to choose that in checkout, so they went ahead and gave me that because I have a GTX 1080. Speaking of specs, I'm gonna put those in the description so you guys can see the exact build I got and compare it to your own or even buy it yourself. But I will let you know to highlight it, I do have 16 gigs of RAM, DDR3000, like I said, an Intel Core i7 7700K processor, as well as a GTX 1080 graphics card. I also did get some free RBG smart lighting with this computer, with this build. It's an offer they were doing. Now, there's also gonna be some free stuff that I got inside of here. I know that the promotion they're doing now, you can get the same uh, accessories for $5 a piece, but when I bought mine, I actually got it absolutely free and I'm extremely excited about that. So we're gonna go ahead with no further ado and go ahead and get into the unboxing. I got my trusty knife here and let's dig in. I hope I don't cut too deep here. We are good. Oh yeah. So we got some nice padding in here. And there's quite a few things here in this box. So I'm gonna go ahead and get right into them. First thing we have here, looks like the iBuy Power, just standard gaming mouse. I will unbox all of these things in this video as well. Uh, what else do we have? Got a, uh, a little baggie here. I'm assuming this is just like some software type stuff in here, but we'll check it out real quick. I got a free year of McAfee Antivirus Plus, which we're gonna set that over here, as well as like some uh, startup guides for the motherboard, which is an MSI. Just some uh, Windows reinstallation disk, some MSI disk, and then of course, I would assume this is the uh, power supply cord to the power brick. So we're gonna uh, throw these things back in here. Let's get into the next uh, piece of equipment I have here. Like this is the um, Gamdias Hephaestus 2. I don't really know how to say this, but this is the headset they gave me. I believe I'm also supposed to have a free keyboard in here. I'm gonna be a little bit upset if that's not in there, but uh, this is, yeah, the headset they gave me. I'll be unboxing this as well. We're gonna go ahead and get this out of the way for the moment. All right, guys, I'm gonna fight and try to get this thing on out of here. And yep, I feel the keyboard in there. Oh my goodness, this thing is heavy. Okay. Woo. Here is the PC itself. We will get to this in just a moment. This is the iBuyPower Mech Mechanical Keyboard. Now, before I get into the actual build itself, we're going to take a look at some of the other stuff that we have here. 
Starting off, I want to talk about the iBuy Power Mech Mechanical Keyboard. I'm really excited for this. I actually was running a Razer Black Widow that I've had for a couple years. And so now we're going to get into um, this mechanical keyboard. It, it is red backlit. It has built-in memory. Uh, I'm not really sure which switches it has on it. So what sound it's going to make. But I know, I believe it's a more of a quiet keyboard. So with that being said, let's just go ahead and dive right into it. Remember guys, I got all of these things for free and I buy power tends to do these type of things like pretty often with these free promos and whatnot. So make sure you guys are checking out their website all the time. Right now you can get this keyboard with the purchase of a PC for only $5. Uh, you can get the Norton antivirus for $5 and you can also get that headset for only $5. And man, this thing is really well packaged. I'm extremely excited. Okay, so we've got the uh, keyboard itself. It really, really nice wires on this. I'm really liking this. So this is a little bit smaller than the last keyboard that I had, and I'm really, really excited about this. So this is a really nice keyboard. I think it has the MX Red switches. That's what it sounds like, and uh, I'm really liking how that's sounding. That's going to sound great while gaming. It's really small and compact, so I'm definitely going to have a lot of room to work with, but I'm really excited about this. Um, and I love this braided um, wiring here for your uh, USB. So it also does come with just the uh, the thing to remove the keys if you need to and like a quick start guide. Here we have the standard iBuyPower gaming mouse. I don't think this is really anything to write home about. I think it's pretty standard. I'm just going to tear the hell out of the box. Uh, nothing really special in there. As you can see, it comes out of this nice plastic and it's pretty it's pretty nice. It's, it's an upgrade from my last. I had like a standard Razer uh, mouse. The mouse wheel is really nice. There's buttons on the side. So if you're playing like your MMOs or whatever and you don't, you know, have the one with all the buttons right here, you can just, you know, you can use this. It's, it's really simple. It's not a big deal, but it's a pretty nice little mouse. So the last piece we're going to get into is this Gamdia's headset. I don't really know how to say this. Hephaestus, something like that. But uh, it's a pretty nice looking headset. It looks like the box did get crushed just a little bit, about five seconds from just tearing into the box. That's what's going to happen. Sorry guys, my camera just completely cut out. Uh, I'm actually using an iPhone 7 camera, so great quality on the iPhone, but uh, I had I got a call. But anyway, so here's the new uh, headset that I'll be running with. Uh, this is actually my first like official PC specific headset. Most of the ones that I had were pretty much just for like Xbox, um, but this is my first PC only headset. Um, and I'm really excited and it looks extremely comfortable. Like I really cannot wait to uh, Go ahead and pop this on and use this. As a matter of fact, I'm going to hang it in its new home right now on my uh, trusty gaming desk over here. Now, guys, this is the moment you have all been waiting for. It is time to unbox this computer. So I'm going to give you guys just a little bit of a better look at the box. So, I do have the Phantom, um, the Chimera 5 uh, Snow Edition, I believe, is the name of this actual uh, case that it's in. This is the moment I have been waiting almost a month for. I'm trying not to cut too deep and there it is. I see the top of it already and this thing is huge. I did not expect it to actually be this large. And wow. Yes, there is something else. So something I forgot to mention that they gave me for free um, that I believe is $5 now is this really, really nice gaming, uh, wow, this is really, really nice. I got this really nice gaming, uh, game, game, gaming mouse pad. I almost called it a game pad. So with that being said, let's go ahead and remove the plastic. And here it is. This is, this is my build. Oh my goodness. Okay guys, so here is the build itself. This is a really, really nice case. We've got this, uh, got this on here. And uh, I'm gonna take this plastic out and just make sure everything is uh, working right or looking right. And we will go ahead and take a look on the inside of the Okay computer. guys, so I've gotten everything taken out of the boxes and set up. I have, there are still boxes everywhere. 
I'm still not completely done. I still got to set my microphone up and uh, a couple of other things, but for the most part, I've got the PC up and running. Got all my new stuff set up over here. Uh, my brand new gaming monitor. I'm installing. Uh, re, um, Jesus Christ, what am I trying to say? I'm installing my brand new graphics drivers uh, with the NVIDIA GeForce Experience, which it just cut out to do that. Installation has been completed, but let's take a look at this guy down here. So I may have to end up investing in a bigger desk. Um, but I'm extremely excited to have this and I'm just gonna get all up under here. It's a wiry mess, but uh, Yeah, here is the PC. Uh, there's my GTX 1080 uh, They actually sent me an 800 watt power supply, which is better than what I thought I was gonna be getting I thought I was gonna be getting a 700 watt uh, This whole system is water-cooled um, And there's the water cooler right there uh, Going on to the uh, processor and then as you can see we got 16 gigs of RAM I haven't messed with the RBG smart lighting just yet, but I'm going to uh, here in just a minute. Um, but yeah, it's that's pretty much it. Like I'm extremely excited. I'm happy to have it. Um, like I say, I may need to get a, a bigger desk just because I don't really have a whole lot of leg room. But this is this is this is it, man. This is what I work for. Got my uh, flight joystick there for Star Citizen, and yeah. So I just wanted to show that to you guys. I'm extremely excited. Extremely happy. Um, and it, it feels good. It really does. When you work hard for something and you finally achieve it, it is a wonderful feeling. I've been wanting this since I was a knee-high grasshopper, man. So it feels really good to my heart. Um, definitely one of the more exciting moments in my life. Just something I always worked for. I know a lot of people are like, man, it's just a computer. It's just video games. But it's something that means a lot to me. So thanks, guys, for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe on this video. And check me out. Check out our Twitch streams. And, uh, yeah, McGee TV, we are back. It is good to be back. See you guys next time.